Welcome back to the coolest show in town. You can ask anybody that knows me, one of my favorite parts of the 757 is the food, and especially seafood. So I'm super excited about our next guest. Please join me in welcoming Alan from the Virginia Beach Seafood Festival. Hey, hey. What's, going on? what's going on? What's going on? Welcome to Living 757. I got the perfect event for you. Yes, yeah. I know you do. It's gonna be good. I'm so excited. So when and where is this seafood festival? All right, so it's happening October 21st. Now, for those of us who are from Hampton Roads, we have called it Camp Pendleton for years. Yep. It's the co uh, the uh, uh, Naval Reserve base that's down at the oceanfront. Right. Basically right there at the end of Birdneck and General Booth Boulevard, kind of diagonal from the aquarium. Okay. Which I never thoroughly thought about the people, the fish in the aquarium and seafood festival happen right across the street. But anyway, we won't think, we won't think about that. We won't tell any of the people at the aquarium <laughs> what we're doing that day, right? Exactly right, exactly right. Now, what kind of foods can you find there? What kind of vendors? Is there gonna be food for people who don't like seafood? All right, so this is what's really cool about this. Literally, the area's best restaurants, and it could be Zoe's that we're talking about, or Blue Pete's, or it could be Scrimp Shack, some of the best food trucks. Everything that's seafood related, they converge down there, and it is an amazing event. Yeah, there'll be some food, obviously, for if you're not a seafood lover, but really and truly, come for the seafood. Yeah, mm -hmm. if you're going to this food event, it's for the seafood. Now, can you like crack crabs? Will there be crab legs? There's there's a little bit of everything. We let the restaurants come up with their, their dish. And what's really cool is because they are actually competing, right. then they're really putting out their best stuff because they want to be judged. They want to go away with the trophy. Oh, they're competing. So, yeah, so you're the real winner by going around and eating all the food because then you're able to, you know, sample the best that these restaurants have to offer. So who votes? There's some a panel of secret judges that go around and vote. Yeah. Alan. Yeah, yeah. You oh, know, you, you had me judge to... <laughs> the wings. I am offended that you didn't call me oh, well, for the secret. Well, it's no longer a secret now. It's no longer a secret. That, you know, no, but it, 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 our, we'll have a special prize and an award just for you to give out. But no, it's, 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 it's amazing. Again, these guys put out some fantastic food. The event last year was one of the best food festivals that I've ever been to, and we have been to a lot of them. Yes, we uh, have. And uh, we're looking forward to October 21st. So what else is happening there besides the food? So there's a kid zone, there's bands, there's entertainment. I mean, it's it's really, we make it so that it's a lot of fun for everybody. Yep. So bring your kids, come and plan on spending the day, spend time there. We want you to eat as many plates as you can. Time to digest, kick yeah. back, relax, watch the bands, you know, and have, be entertained. And the bands are two really good bands. Yeah, so we've got we've got great lineup, we've got great DJs, and it's all at vbcfoodfestival.com. You can go check it out and see. So exciting, and it's not just a party, it's a party for a cause. So where's the money going? All right, so the Virginia gentleman who put this on, which I'm very proud to be a part of, and the, all the money goes right back to the community. So whether that's Camp Grom, which is a beautiful camp that is there for uh, kids with disabilities, um, people with disabilities, Gold Star families, wounded veterans, uh, the first handicap accessible park, um, which is built in the United States, is right there at the oceanfront. And that's also supported by the Virginia gentleman. And then you guys have seen probably the Grombulance driving around yes. town, the ambulance for CHKD that's all painted up. That's also paid for and supported by the Virginia gentleman. So all the money and the donations go right back here to the community with assets that you can literally see like, wow, where did the money from my seafood festival ticket go? Yep. It went to this awesome ambulance zipping down 264, saving a kid's life. So funny story before we get to this game we're gonna play, my son actually rode in that ambulance. Really? He had croup. And and urgent care couldn't handle it, so they called CHKD, and my husband was like, he was so scared, but then he saw this colorful ambulance, and he automatically felt better. That's a great story, I never knew that. That's yeah. great, yeah, well, yeah, yeah that's, that's where your tickets for the CQ Festival are gonna go. Yeah. I, love yeah, I love it. So you know we don't like to do straightforward interviews on this show, we're gonna <laughs> no, play a fun that. little okay. game, we're gonna play our rendition of Pictionary, there's okay. gonna be no winners, because there are no teams. Okay. But we'll get bragging rights for either being terrible or really, or really great. Artists, Artist? I guess. Okay, all right, fair. All right, fair. so you can draw first. You're okay. the guest. Okay, so I'm gonna draw first. Or yep. I'm gonna draw first. You pick up the card and then you draw it, and I have to guess. Oh, okay, got it, got it, got it, got it. Oh, okay, cool. All okay. Right. All right, ready? All right, you gotta okay. hold it up so the camera can oh, see oh, it so a little bit. Oh, so the camera can see Oh, it's wait. Okay, got it, got it, got it, got it. All right. right. Okay, if you don't, yeah, you got this. Um. Mermaid. You got it. See how easy that was. Yes. <laughs> all right. Yes. All right, now what? All right, all now right. Now it's your turn? Yep. Okay. Mermaid. That, this, was, that was my mermaid. This is Alan's mermaid. <laughs> it's, it's terrible. It's terrible. I don't know it. She got hit by a boat. I don't know what's going on. That's okay. On. All right. Oh, goodness. Okay. okay. Yeah, yeah, I got this. All right. SpongeBob? Yeah! <laughs> We're good at this. There we go. This I, I don't even have kids. <laughs> <laughs> that looks even worse on camera. I'm sorry, Alan. I'm sorry. All right. Now, 
Now what? We got time for one more. Okay. So you pick right, the next right, got card. Got it, got it, got it, got it, got it, got it, got it. Let's see if we can be three for three. Oh, okay. All right. Ooh, this one's gonna be tough. This one's gonna be tough. Okay. Um. All right. How do I do this? Um. Okay. Fish. Uh huh. Um. And then how do I do this? I don't know. How School I'm, of fish. No. Let me just. Goldfish. How do I? I love fish because they're so delicious. How do I? Uh, this one's this East one's, Australian current. No, like, and I'm not allowed to. I'm not a no, fish stick. Uh, boom! That's it. Fish sticks. You got it. You got it. That's it. That's it. I didn't know how to. I didn't. That's what sticks in a tree, <laughs> and I don't know. Oh my yeah, goodness! So. Now.